All right, so what we're doing today is we're taking this two by two quarter wall angle iron and we're rebuilding a trailer frame. Trailer frame is one of those cheap ones, you know, gets beat up. They're real flimsy, et cetera, et cetera. Usually they're made out of the eighth wall material. So we're rebuilding to the exact same four by eight dimensions, but we're using the heavier material. You know what, you guys have probably seen me do enough cutting and layout on this channel. Let's skip to the welding. All right, if you look really close here, you can see this little tiny dot here made by the manufacturer on the front of that trailer tongue. And you can see we've got our spring perch welded on each side. This is still not welded. So let's do this. Let's hook a tape on that spring perch over there. Let's see how much I can do here without making you guys seasick. Okay, you can see that's hooked on there. Let's look down here. We have exactly 90 and a half to that manufacturer mark. Let's go over here. Okay. What do we got there? Looks like we got 90 and 7 sixteenths. We're a sixteenth out. But you can see there that's how how we set them up and that's going to give you a trailer that tracks nice and true and straight down the road. You want to have a perfect triangle between those three points. How's it going out here? Good. Good? I'm trying to figure out what right there, oh, you have to adjust that, I think. Good job. We'll get that axle taken off and then you can help me put it on the new trailer. So we got the tank between the cross members here. Hangers. And we triangulated the front here. Got that all welded in. We've got to do some straps. We'll take the fenders off the old trailer, put the axle on, and then I've also got to get the rear bumper where the tube will store. Um, right now you can just go play and hang out.
Okay, fast forward and the trailer is back. It went to my brother's shop, he painted it. He uh, drew up this building actually on his CNC here. And this is what it came out as. Got a, it's getting an in-swing door here. I'm actually doing some of the plumbing, that's why it's back here. Um, on demand, little vanity, toilet. A couple of switches up here and uh, yeah, it's just a, a nice DIY porta potty. RV tank underneath. Getting a dump hose in the bumper that we put on there. Outlet. But yeah, that's what it came back as. So, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Thumbs up, like, share, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you on the next one.